I purchased this lipstick because I loved its packaging. Yeah, it's nice. But I'm ordering another bottle after this one is finished. Oh, I'm going to have some little predictions. They create a mess on my face. When I see another cream for dry skin, I decide to give it a chance, basically. Why I love this packaging. Welcome to another day of vlogmas welcome back to my channel if you're new my name is anna and here i'm vlogging about all the things i love in life beauty fashion travel home and so much more this video is going to be a beauty haul another christmas day is here we have my christmas decorations on i have my cozy sweater on my earrings all of my jewelry is from apm monaco my headband is from h&m i am very satisfied with this purchase because i really wanted to have a similar headband but all of the ones that i saw were like for hundred dollars and this one is budget friendly so i'm very happy about this purchase i have recently had quite big orders from sephora and iherb some of them arrived yesterday some of them arrived a week ago i decided to put all the products together in one video and discuss them with you as a whole i have tried some of the products already some of them i haven't tried tried yet we're going to discuss everything and maybe you will get some important information for yourself or have some inspiration for the presents for your loved ones with all this being said let's get into the video with the product that i want to start the video with is a face moisturizing cream this is pixie skin treats rose ceramic cream neutralizing moisturizer uh, so this is ultra rich moisture cream formulated with ceramics to boost hydration and seal in moisture for plump looking skin the cream looks like this you can see by the way it looks that i've tried this one already i used it each day during the last week and what i can say is it smells amazingly it smells like roses i had good reaction of my skin to this cream it didn't make my skin break out my skin was moisturized after applying this one it didn't feel worse which is already good i think the main effect of this cream is that it's going to improve the state of your skin over time it's going to make your skin healthier in a way but you have to be patient and i think we can speak about the results after i finish the whole tube not not after one week but as for now i'm satisfied with this purchase the next one is another skincare product this is a serum this is the ordinary Metric Seal 10% plus HA, a high strength peptide formulation serum. Looks like this. This is a transparent serum. Basically, what this one is supposed to do, it is supposed to make your skin look plumper, make your wrinkles go away as much as it is possible, actually, make your skin texture more even of course this product can't do wonders but i think with time it is supposed to work we just have to be patient because the bottle is quite big and you you just need one drop for your face and i'm not using it for the whole of my face i'm just using it for my forehead because that's the only place where i feel like i need this kind of serum i have my wrinkles on my forehead since i was like 12. after one week i can't say anything about this product I hope it's going to work, we'll see. The next product is from the same brand as the previous one. This is The Ordinary and this is a peeling product. This is the first peeling product in my life, actually. I have never tried peelings before, I was quite afraid of them because after the peeling products, it is very often that your skin gets really red and dry and my skin is really dry generally, so I didn't want it to be even worse. But after seeing some videos on YouTube, looking at the reviews i decided to give a try to this peeling this is the ordinary lactic acid 10 percent plus ha a high strength lactic acid superficial peeling formulation looking like this it's light orange color very liquid i have to say after one time using this one i am satisfied my skin didn't get too dry after this product my skin didn't get red it felt absolutely fine you have to use this product once per 10 days or once per two weeks, something like this. And it is supposed to give your skin a new life, kind of, to give it renewal and to make it healthier with time. I really have hopes for this product. We'll see how it's going to work 
for now just tried it once i think this bottle is going to last more than a year so we'll discuss it then next i want to make a break in skincare and move to makeup the first makeup i have here is a concealer i have unpacked this one not nicely sorry this is a concealer i wanted to try for a long time this is a giorgio armani lumina silk concealer i think this is a famous concealer right now as Lumina Silk is a very famous foundation, it's a great foundation and I wanted to try concealer because the foundation is great so maybe the concealer will be great too. So this one I tried two times and I have mixed feelings about it. The first time I tried it I felt that it was great but the second one I felt like it made my skin dry. And the result, I think that it is a perfect concealer for your under eye area, but you can't apply it to other places like where you want to hide your imperfections, for example. If you try to hide your imperfection, it's going to make it just more visible and it's going to make your skin dry in that place. So for the under eye, it's perfect. It has light texture, it has good coverage, it feels light on your skin. But other areas, no, no, no. It's, it's just for the under eye area and that's it. But... I don't regret that I bought this one. The next product I have here is a lipstick. This lipstick is Chanel lipstick. If I am very honest with you, I purchased this lipstick because I loved its packaging. When I saw the packaging, I was like, wow, it's super, it's super fun. Why? I love this packaging. It's beautiful matte. It has Chanel logo here. And to open it, you need to press and it gets out. I don't know. I just consider it so cool that I wanted to grab it. So I grabbed it. The color is great as well, so it's not just for the packaging. This is the perfect everyday color for me. I love dusty rose kind of shades for lipsticks for my everyday life. This is a matte lipstick. I love matte lipsticks, so this is a win-win for me. Uh, this one is from the collection Velvet Extreme of Chanel, and the color is 118 Eternel. I have not tried this lipstick yet. I'm about to tomorrow. I love the way it looks. I hope that it works as good as it looks. We're going to see. Next, I have more skincare here. This is the product that I used each day during the last week and I loved it. I actually loved it. This is a cleansing foam for your face. This is Aquel, Aquel 5.5 pH Balancing Micro Cleansing Foam. So what this cleansing phone is supposed to do, it is supposed to calm down your skin and clean it basically. And my skin reacted very well to this foam. It didn't get dry, it didn't break out. It felt very healthy and clean after this foam. So I'm very satisfied and I can promise you that I'm ordering another bottle after this one is finished as I feel really good about this product. Next is another product which is connected to cleansing. This is cleansing water. I have two bottles as you can see here because I really love this product. I've already had this one before and I decided that I'm not going to go for another cleansing water. I'm going to stick to this brand. This brand is called Scenic, the simple pure cleansing water. This is the box and inside of the box you have the bottle. Why I like this cleansing water for cleaning my face and removing my makeup is because of its pH. It has 5.5 pH and this is a perfect pH for your skin. If you didn't know, most mass market cleansing products, cleansing waters, they have the wrong pH for your skin and they are basically hurting your skin and making it drier and you actually need to look for the cleansing products with a pH 5.5 in order to create this pH balance for your skin and for your skin to be in its healthiest mode you know the most important thing that we can do for our skin is not to irritate it not to make it feel worse we need to keep it healthy and we need to keep our epidermal barriers of our skin strong and healthy and the products which have perfect ph which is 5.5 is very important for your skin so this one is done next product is a disappointment unfortunately this is another face cream. I have seen this face cream quite a lot on Instagram and on the videos of some influencers. And when I see another cream for dry skin, I decide to give it a chance basically. And this one sounded really promising for me. This is Lano Lanolin All Over Golden Dry Skin Salve, Salve Cream. So this one looks like this, a golden tube. I think this one is a travel size, not a, not a normal size, but I'm very happy I didn't buy the normal size because I don't like this cream. I have not given this one a lot of chances yet. 
my first impressions are really bad uh, the texture of this cream is very thick i will try to show you if if you can see uh, this cream is very thick and kind of dark yellow so what you normally do you get a little droplet on your fingers and you rub it uh, you rub it like this and then you apply it to your face spread it all over and it is supposed to make your dry skin feel better but in my impression it just made me feel greasy oily it was too heavy on my skin and my skin didn't react well it went red uh, it it felt like it was too thick and too heavy for me i'm sorry i didn't like this one i think i'm going to give it more chances because so many people are fond of this one and maybe i didn't apply it right maybe i did something wrong we'll see but for now it is a no from me the last product from the skincare section is another serum this serum i have in my life for the first time uh, this is a retinol serum how to get this one out okay this is a retinol serum i have had a retinol serum before but i had another brand this one is cos de baja cosmetic de baja retinol 2.5 serum hyaluronic acid vitamin e b3 intensive wrinkle care the bottle looks like this i hope this one works just fine my previous retinol serum helped me with my breakouts when i had them i think you have to apply retinol once per week something like this and it is supposed to help you with your acne or with your signs of aging i used it on my breakouts and it worked fine and i loved it it helped to get the texture and the tone of my skin more even and I don't know if this brand is going to work but I hope it is going to work because I really can't wait to have another retinol serum in my life so I will give this one a chance next I have another makeup product here and this is a product I didn't really understand so this is a primer as you know I really love primers and from time to time I try to give new primers a chance in my life and this one was really promising when i tried it in the shop i was like excited the shop assistant told me that this one is one of the best moisturizing primers so this is dior backstage face and body primer the bottle is cool and it looks like this with some dior logo okay i didn't understand this one after i applied my dior concealer on top of this primer the primer started getting into little pieces on my face it didn't stay even it just everything was ru ruined on my face basically i don't know maybe i have to look for another concealer to pair with this primer for now it just doesn't work like my basic concealer is this concealer from dior dior forever skin correct concealer and these two together don't work they create a mess on my face i really have strong hopes for this primer i will give it more chances we'll see next i have a product which is a product for my home uh, this is mayer's mrs mayer's clean day multi-surface concentrate uh, so this is kind of a concentrate which you mix with water and you use it to clean basically everything in your home I've had other scents of this uh, product. I've had some, I think it was the orange cover. I don't remember the name of the scent, but I really love the product. This one is a good one to clean your home. I use this product to clean basically everything and in my home and the smells are usually great. I have not tried this one yet. I'm going to try the smell with you. Yeah, it's nice it's nice it's going to be good for it's going to be good for cleaning my home i'm showing you this one today because i really love it and i wanted to recommend it to you next i have another product from iherb here this is fish oil omega-3 uh, 1000 milligrams 120 soft gels i think all of you know that omega-3 is very good for your health for your skin for your hair for your nails and it's good to take it from time to time and now i decided that it's time for me so i ordered a bottle and the last product is not connected to beauty but i ordered it from iherb so i decided to put it in this video this is tea this is yogi soothing caramel bedtime tea 
I wanted to try tea from this brand basically because I saw that it's cute that on each tea bag they have some little nice words for you for your day and this worked for me like oh I'm going to have some little predictions or some nice words for my tea whatever so I chose soothing caramel bedtime tea I tried this tea yesterday for the first time and it is not very it is not exactly what i expected i expected something similar to black caramel tea and this one is very herbal caramel tea which is a little bit strange but maybe i will get used to it maybe not we'll see this was the last product for today's video i really hope that it was interesting for you that you found something useful for yourself if you like this video please put the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel i will be very grateful see you for another day of vlogmas